Ross Dwelly said you were the only coach in the NFL that went to his pro day. How did he get on your radar in the first place? Uh, <laughs> I just watched his tape. I just worked. Yeah. <laughs> How much, I mean, he was an undrafted guy. How many tight ends do you normally watch a year? Um, I probably watched 60 to 65. And what was it about his game that drew your attention? Uh, I loved, uh, he, he played physical. I thought he had borderline elite hands. And he was a good route runner. He was very savvy. He knew how to create space and get in and out of breaks. He reminded me a lot when I was watching him. He, I felt like I was watching Cam Braid again. Yeah. And, you know, I had Cam down in Tampa. Uh, similar situation. Cam played at Harvard. Didn't play a lot of football. Ross is at a program where they don't play a lot of football from the standpoint camp isn't the same like at other schools. Spring balls might be different. I know in the Ivy Leagues you don't do all. So not a lot of football, but the football they did play was enough to feel like I wanted. To. I felt like if I could work with them that we'd have a chance to, you know, have some success and be a football player in this league. So you have experience scouting tight ends from smaller schools that maybe some tight end coaches and scouts wouldn't take as seriously? Uh, I don't know about that. I just, I don't know, maybe it's my college background. You know, you only get so many guys a year in scholarship, so you better not miss. Yeah. Um, and so I, I, I try to watch everybody that's coming out. I, I really do. I try yeah. to do it. Yeah, it's a lot of work. Yeah. It's a lot easier. To, you're a better coach if you have better players. I know that. All right? Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, that's that's not an issue for me. I love watching kids play on tape, you know. So um, for me, it's just dotting some eyes, crossing the T's. Um, usually, with a scouting situation set up, they give you uh, a list of guys yeah. to, to evaluate, and then what I also have them do is give me all draft eligible tight ends coming out. Mm -hmm. And then I just grind it, going through it, and grind it, and kind of look at. It. You can know early. She can be in five clips in on a guy and be like, "Ooh, okay, no." Yeah. Okay. You know what I mean? Yes. So you just kind of. How much has Ross improved in the three years he's been here? Three, four years? Yeah, I don't know how many years. He's gotten better though every year. He really has. Uh, you know, he's one of my uh, favorite guys that I've coached uh, in my career. I really like. Uh, uh, he's a pro. He's been a pro from day one. He comes in prepared, asks the right questions, he takes care of his body, eats right. Like he does everything that he needs to do to give himself a chance to have success.